This is a short walkthrough introducing new users to the Reddit interface. We're currently looking at what's called the new interface. There is also an old interface that many Reddit users still use and a mobile interface that looks a lot like the new interface. Um, on this page, we're currently looking at one of the three possible views. This view is called the classic view. It shows us the text of the posts, their title, and a little um, thumbnail beside it for images and video. If we switch to the compact view, we'll see only text. And if we switch to the card view, all of the images and videos will be expanded to a larger size. Videos will also autoplay as we scroll through. See, If we switch back to the classic view, I can show you some of the features of each Reddit post. Let's say that I'm interested in this post here. If I click on it, it'll show the post, but it'll also give me an opportunity to comment it below. If I wrote a comment now, and post, my comment will show up below. Notice that my comment is already upvoted by me. If I decided I wanted to downvote it instead, I can click the downvote button, but I'm going to switch it back to upvote. You can do this for any of the comments, and the score for each comment is listed beside the user's name. For the post itself, it's much the same. Up for upvote, down for downvote, and it'll show you the overall score in between the two votes. If I wanted to go to this subreddit in particular, I can click RA for Reddit A, and it'll show me only posts from that subreddit. If I didn't like this content, I could unsubscribe by clicking this button over here, or I could click this button to create my own post. Many subreddits offer you three different options for how to post. You can post a text post here, an image or video in the center, or a link to a different website here. If you'll notice, on Reddit all, uh, text posts are disabled. It has to be an image or video, or a link to a different site that is showing an image or video. All of the subreddits that I'm subscribed to are in this drop-down menu. As you can see here, I subscribed to the 10 that I recommended for you. If I were to click on any of these, it would take me to that specific subreddit, and I could find out more information there. For example, if I clicked on RA, we go back to RA. Many subreddits have related subreddits on the right-hand side menu below the rules. This one has a particularly long list of related subreddits. RA is uh, about cute animals and babies and so forth. So um, if you really liked the content here, you might also like some of these uh, subreddits over here. For example, dog pictures. If I clicked on that, I'd get only dog pictures. If I subscribe to this subreddit by clicking that button, now dog pictures will show up in my subscriptions. And if I go back to the home page for Reddit, I should find some dog pictures in my feed. There's one right there. Those are the basics of Reddit. Um, the view options, how to upvote and downvote, how to post and comment, and how to subscribe and unsubscribe from uh, specific subreddits. I suggest taking the time to go through Reddit and test out some of these features, particularly looking at which subreddits you are interested in. As I said, what shows up in your feed are all of the subreddits you're subscribed to. So Reddit will only be as good as the subreddits that you subscribe to. Going through and finding ones that are particularly inter interesting to you will make your Reddit experience much better.